Hi everybody, so today I'm going to teach you how to do um, that tutorial of how you make that look that um, Jamboree has in that photo that they created with the Glitz and Glam um, nail lacquer kit. So to start off, go and look down here with me. Um, if you are unfamiliar with the new kits that Jamboree offers, these are the three different kits and we're going to be using the Glitz and Glam kit today. Um, so to start off, get this out of our way here. What you'll need to do is go ahead and prep your nails by pushing back your cuticle and clipping your cuticles if they need clipped. And then I always like to, whether I'm putting on nail wraps or doing polish, I still like to alcohol my nails just so that it gets them a nice clean surface and um, gets all the oils and stuff off. So the first step that we're going to do, well, let me show you. You're going to need a tiny little brush that looks like this. just has a small end on it. So make sure you have one of those. If you don't have one, they're easy to find it, just like a craft store. So start with your base coat, whether you like the smoothing or the strengthening. I used the smoothing today. And you're going to polish all your nails with the smoothing base coat. Okay. And go ahead and go through them all and do them all. Then your next step is you're going to take the color frosting in the Glitz and Glam. And the frosting, you're going to do two really thin coats, making sure to let them dry in between on every nail. And while we're waiting for that one to dry, I went ahead and just did the nail head of each one. So this one's ready for the next step. So after you've gotten your two coats of the frosting, then you're going to go ahead and take the Midas, which is this gold color. And this is where you're going to need your brush, so make sure you have it handy. And you're going to start back by your cuticle, and you're going to polish a little over a third of the way down, okay? And then take your paintbrush, what you're going to do is you're just going to try to drag it out just a little bit to make that a little bit uneven there, just so it kind of fades in. You're kind of doing a, a somewhat of an ombre effect there. Okay. So once you get that done and you let it dry, then you'll be on to the next one. So you're going to go back and take your frosting again, and you're going to make a small little moon shape kind of toward, back towards the cuticle. This gives you a nice base, so when you're ready to do the, the glitter on top, it, it gives it a nice background. So take your frosting again, and you're just going to go back here with it. You really don't need two coats, just make sure you get enough the first time. It doesn't need to be super covered. Okay, just a minute, sweetie. But I can't put it in it's all blue. can you go help her, please? Thanks. Okay, so once you get that moon shape done and you let it dry, then you're going to be at this point right here. This is when you get out your... Um, New sparkle, why can't I think of the name? Stardust. So get out your stardust. And this comes in the Glitz and Glam um, lacquer kit as well. And you're going to do a layer on top. And you're going to let that dry because you're going to do two coats of this, but you don't want it to be too thick that it doesn't dry well. So do your first coat here. Let it dry and then do your second coat. Once your second coat is all the way dry, then what you're going to do is you're just going to take your Ultra Shine top coat. And you're going to go ahead and just go over all of your nails with the Ultra Sign top coat. Okay. And then just give it adequate time to dry so they don't um, get too bulky. Make sure you're giving it time in between each nail. Um, so anyways, this is kind of your finishing result of what you get. Um, it's not hard to do, and that's my right hand, so I did that with my left, so forgive any small mistakes on there, because you know how that is. But um, that's pretty much all you have to do. It's very easy. So if you want this um, lacquer kit, you can go to my website. It's www.annahone.jamburynails.net, and go ahead and purchase that. Um, if you have any questions about the tutorial or need a little more help, then just, you know, you can private message me or comment below on this thread, and I can get back to you. Thanks. Bye.